Hello beautiful eyeshadow lovers, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going over my update number one on the Roulette Project Pan collab number six. Yeah, this is the sixth round that luckily now we get to join. This was made by Alexi and Rebecca Morgan. They will both be linked down below and the same with the playlist that they created for us. So we're going to quickly go through the products that I haven't finished and then the ones I have finished. So the first one I have right here, just in random order, this I pulled number 17, which is a product out of your comfort zone. The color is out of my comfort zone for sure. It is like this really pinky shade right here. It is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Matte Lipstick in Orchid. Here is my progress, where it started to now. I'm hoping, I'm, I'm pretty sure that this is going to be done by next month. I just have to use more pink lipstick. My dog. <laughs> I have to feed her. Excuse me. Okay, I don't know exactly where we left off after she, or before she started crying, but I have used this lipstick 29, yeah, 29 times, that's insane, insane, but I don't count days of use, I count reapplications, I can just throw it in my purse and count on it, little <laughs> piece of paper on how many uses I put, and then come back home to my notebook and jot them all down, anyway, next product, this is the I pulled the number 13, which is a product you got as a gift. This is the MAC Single Shadow in Sushi Flower. It looks like so now. I have used it five times. I actually filmed me receiving this. I'll link the video up above for you. And I got this from Debbie Knobloch, who has a channel. She's amazing, wonderful, beautiful, magical, sweet, and just amazing. I will link her channel down below if you want to go watch her. So I'm hoping within the next few months this will be gone. I hear how hard MAC shadows are and I want to complete it. My third item I pulled was, this is the last one I didn't complete. This is, I pulled number five which was a product you bought because of YouTube. Now, I wanted to do the Marc Jacobs bronzer. Well, with that, uh, <laughs> it's not really a summer, it, it's really a summer tone. It's not full out fall like I want to be. So I pulled in a highlight instead. I had used the Tantastic bronzer 10 times. I mean, I te technically didn't hit pan and I think I was trying to use it 30 times, but oh well. This is the Soph X from Makeup Revolution, the highlighting palette, and I'm painting this one right here. It's what I have on today, if you can tell. It's super beautiful. I love it. It looks like I'm all greasy, but it's okay. What are you going to do? Let's go ahead and move on to the finished products. I have this pen pencil in my head. Okay, so the first finished product that I have is I pulled number 32 which is something in your favorite shade and right now I'm really like knee deep in fall <laughs> and I pulled this Fenty Beauty Mademoiselle lipstick in the shade Freckle Fiesta super beautiful I'll show you a picture of when I used it I was supposed to use this 30 times and I did yesterday was use number 27 28 29 and 30 I re reapplied it like crazy that day. I eat and drink and I apply my makeup in the morning. So that was fun. If you need a reference, this is where I started and this is where I got to. After 30 uses, that's pretty well and I really, really like this. So I will be putting that away for now. My second number out of the three that I hit my goals on was this old perfume. This is Gucci Flora by Gucci Glorious Mandarin. 
Did you can read that. This is something we just get in a, um, what are those? What are, scent bird, yes? And I just completed it. it what does, it reminds me of something, but I can't put my mind to it. And it just, it's a too much of a mature scent for me, you know, but I'm getting there, but I'm not there yet. <laughs> okay, the last and third, the last and final item that I completed is, we got the number, we, I got the number 34, and it was something underrated, and I chose this e.l.f. setting spray. Now, I was almost all the way, it almost looked like I hadn't used this product, and I completed it. I have used it 40 times. 40 times. Yes, this intro, the intro was pre-filmed about two weeks before I put out the video, so I kind of cheated and gave myself a little bit of extra time. That's probably why I was finished. That's probably why I was able to finish up so many items. By the way, the perfume, I didn't mention it. I have I had used it 27 times before it was done. So, I'm so excited because I get to choose new numbers. Now, I do my project a little differently than I think either everybody or most people. But I said, okay, if I got the numbers already, cool. If I have finished the product or my goal, I will not choose that number again. But let's say last project I pulled the number and I did not finish my goal, I'll keep that number. Make sense? Okay. So I'm gonna go one through 50 and pull three numbers. It always starts on number 49. Why, I don't know. Okay, so number 45, I have not had that yet, so I will write that down. Number two, I have gotten it and completed it. Amy. Number 15, I have not gotten yet. And number 48, which I have not gotten yet either. I'm very excited. Okay, so I'm going to now look at the spreadsheet that we got and pick new items. I'll be right back. Okay, clearly I'm back at a different day, but um, I, I kept going back and forth on my decisions as to what products that I would be picking up for these. So my first number that I drew was 45, and that was a lesser known brand. My second number was 15, and that was a product I haven't used much. And the third number that I pulled is an item I dis considered decluttering. And I think, I think I have made up my mind finally after like two days. <laughs> I didn't want to come back and give you guys like an answer that I didn't want. You know what I'm saying? So, we're going through that right now. Okay, so, the lesser known brand, okay, I chose, if you guys have seen my lipstick roulette, I will link that above for you if you want to watch that. I did pull this item, and in that video I said I would love to pan this. So, this is the lesser known brand, which is called Jelly, P Jelly Pong Pong. I thought it was ping pong, but it's okay. It's jelly pong pong. <laughs> I think it's just so hilarious. And it is a lip oil that looks like that. It smells like childhood. <laughs> you know the um, fake candy or the, that candy smell? I just love it so much. Okay, so lesser known brand, jelly pong pong. It just makes me laugh. Okay, then a product that you have not used much. I'm bringing in another lippy. This is the Kylie Jenner Velvet Liquid Lipstick in the shade Savage. I it's it's separating here at the bottom. You see, but I barely have any lines in it. 
I want to use this not completely up, but I want to get a good feel <laughs> or I want to feel good about the amount of times that I have used it before I toss it out. You know what I'm saying? So this is haven't used much right there. Savage. Savage. <laughs> okay. And then an item you have considered decluttering. I'm bringing in three lip products. I should have probably already said that. But this is the Tartist Lip Paint in Insta Famous. I'm sorry, it makes me laugh. Okay, so it looks like this. It's just like a gloss with some glitter on it. I actually have it above my lipstick today. It's just very fine micro glitters in it. Yes. I did bring in three lip products and I'm probably going to regret it as soon as I upload this video. <laughs> but I need to get done with lip products and I need to do more. So I want to complete this, complete this. I think I'm just going to throw these two in my purse and just go so the numbers may not be correct on them. Actually, I'm going to put all three in my purse. <laughs> okay, so I want to show you on the Kylie I have few little pockets but I want more I want more and I want these two complete so I go through lip glosses like it's nobody's business <laughs> I have completed I think already three this year and to complete five would be amazing and then to I don't I don't have a numbers goal I just want to use it more to where I feel comfortable throwing it out. You know what I'm saying? In the lipstick roulette that I am doing, I told myself, okay, I'm going to use these products five times and put them away in this basket and use the other products five more times. But if I get like a crappy something come up within the next couple months while this project is going, I'm going to be mad. <laughs> so I want these three as a backup so I can use them as much as possible. This Color, I can use all the time. These two, I can use all the time, just in my purse whenever I need a gloss. Because I go to school and I don't really use a lot of makeup. So I feel like having these as a backup is going to be good and hopefully okay. Okay, so for the tart, I think you can see where the product is separating. Can you see that right there in between that gold line? In there and then right here as well you see that just tiny tiny little bowl oh yes girl bring it on I'm ready I'm ready to get this done and I'm gonna count the uses of this and then use lines <laughs> for this one because I can't see through this one but I can see through these so wish me luck I have three three lip products <laughs> I'm screwed <laughs> I already feel it but I I'm hoping for the best. Please give me a big thumbs up down below. Subscribe if you are new. I would love for you to even do this project. I know it's a month late, but I started last round a month late. It's amazing. I love this project. Please go check out the other ladies that I have mentioned previously. And I hope you all have a wonderful day. I'll see you all in my next video. Bye! Thank you.